All right. Hello, everyone. Imam Akana here, and uh, I want to quickly show you in this short video clip uh, how to place your buy and sell order. Okay, now this is your MT4. It works just the same way as MT5. There ain't no difference. The only difference is the assets, the trading assets. Okay, like here you have the, the euro pound, GBP, JPY, gold, USD, JPY, and the likes. All right, uh, you still have these in MT5 and some other uh, assets that are not here. Okay, so they, they basically work the same way. So, quickly, how do you place your buy and sell orders? Now, let's assume I want to sell, I want to buy at this point. Let's assume I want to buy at this point because price is here. All right, what do I do? I'll click on the look at this. I'll click on this plus sign here. This plus sign. Okay, my cursor couldn't get there. The the plus sign here, which is one one two three four five, the fifth uh, icon on the top right hand side. Just click on it. All right. This face. This interface opens up. Okay. This interface opens up. And you have your sell and buy sell is written in red buy is written in blue all right you have your sell and buy underneath here uh, or just where you have your red line okay and your 0 0.11111 0 0.0000 all right 0, 0.00 so the red is your it's your uh, stop loss this is where you place your stop loss why the green line here is where you place your take profit level all right then here is where you pay. Uh, if you want to your lot size if you want to buy with 0 0.2 or 0 0.3 or 0 0.5 this is where you do that okay just enter the your lot size value there then here you have your instant execution in in, in some of the apps you would find it written as market execution they are basically the same thing instant execution and market execution are both same things then you have a buy limit you have a sell limit you have a buy stop you have a sell stop right your your buy your sell stop for example let me show you how your sell stop works uh this is this is a sell market let's assume as the market is okay let's use this point for example now when the price begins to retrace begins to go back up here and you know that you're still going to sell all right so what you do you might want to place your sell stop somewhere around here meaning you are giving the market an order that if price gets to this point the market should open a sell trade for you the the reverse is the case for buy okay if price begins to go up or price is selling and you know that if it gets to if it gets to this point okay if it gets to this point it's going to buy so you place your buy stop here so when, once you do that you're giving the market an order that uh one whenever price gets here he should buy the market should buy automatically with or without your presence so that's just how uh that's just how it it, it works okay that's just how it works all right so if if you enter the trade let's say you enter this trade uh somewhere around here somewhere around here this red candle you enter the trade and you want to take profit at uh, maybe enter the trade just right here maybe when the rsi is around the 70 level and you want to take profit when the rsi gets to uh the 50 level okay so you can just what you do you just uh, you you sold from here and you check your you check your you just draw down and check the value check the value how far you want it to travel how how much profit you want to bag okay this is one way of doing it you just check click on that and check take it down and check the reading 1.3388 that's a profit 1.3388 so you can just come here you can just come here and uh, okay this is gbp usd you can come here and impute and impute your once you slide to the left these uh, icons come up the pencil icon is where you tap on for editing of the take profit and stop loss levels 
all right a 1.33 if it all right so you set that i'm not sure that's correct so let me check let me check again okay one said you bought here i want to take profit somewhere around here 1.30329 okay 1.30329 okay so this is where you now set your take profits because you're selling all right because you're selling now the the reverse is the case for uh stop loss if you enter the trade if you enter the trade to the trade from here all right you can set okay let's let's just kind of as, as an example you see that uh this long you see this long bearish candle from the m30 as soon as it gets here you enter your buy your sell order all right now you want to place a stop loss you can either place it uh, let's assume you want to place it above this red candle you are saying if i enter this trade here if i sold here whenever price if price retraces and goes against me whenever it gets to this point the market should automatically take you out that was the stop loss so you take your you set your stop loss level 1.31126 all right so you set it let's modify it take one if a market closed so we can't do anything now market is closed well, basically that's just how to uh, operate your buy and your sell order although in the in, in soft school of forex trading i'm going to elaborate more on this for those who have registered i'm going to take you uh much into much details about this for now that's all you need to know i remain your boy in money can until we meet again impossible it's nothing ciao